Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass here, and welcome to Hayami-chan, a horror game about buying the wrong anime DVDs. One day, when I was heading home from the store, I passed by some shady looking guy's garage sale. I figured he needed money by the look of him. There was mostly worn down things, but he had DVDs, and I got curious. I stopped by and looked through them, when one of them caught my eye. Nothing really to brag about, but I'm somewhat of an anime nerd. But I've never even heard of this show. The cover had a girl in a Lolita outfit making a pose. Her hair was pink with short curly twin tails. The title was simply Hayami-chan. The man smirked at me and said, That one is a hidden gem. He said I could have it for free, which was odd. But I shrugged it off and accepted. It has since been two weeks, and I can't stop watching the show. And by looking towards the TV, you make the day go faster? Oh no. I would do anything to have Hayami-chan as my real-life girlfriend. Sigh. You fantasize about your anime waifu. What is going on? So you really did make time go faster. Door out. Peephole dialogue. I ever not go outside. Is this a Freddy style game? Window. You look at all the people and sneer. You can see kids, damn kids, playing outside. What is the point of this game? Oh, I'm just gonna watch anime. Mmm, anime. Fit for consumption. Feels like I'm spying my neighbors or something. So that's hurting my eyes a little. So is this just a real life simulator? Just went dark. It's dark, but you can still see the stairwell. Sleep. You can see on. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna not sleep. I still don't get the point of the game. Oh no, I accidentally sleep because I was moving, clicking over there. Day one. Suddenly watch TV. What is my goal in life? Aside from just watching anime and wasting my days away. Alright, let's just go to sleep. Hmm. Suddenly watch TV. I really don't get. Unironically, I think maybe it is we just sit here and watch anime and just go for the days. The entire game is just one big meta commentary in our lives. All we do is just sit here watching anime. Days go by and then we go sleep again and watch more anime. Ah, the life. Now we go to sleep. Okay. Hey! What? We look around the apartment a little. There's nothing there. Hi, am I? Who is that? You look familiar. It's not like I came from outside the. She's gone. I just imagine things. Go back to sleep. It's everything's okay. You went back to bed. What and who was that? It looked like a person, but the silhouette was off. Must have been a girl. It looked like they were wearing a dress. 
Okay, I get it. It's not a Freddy game. Who was that person? At least Hayami Chen calms me down. It's a... You're, you're, it's a... You are literally just watching anime. This is just normal life. And it's, it just gets worse. I'm assuming that's the actual point. Everything's okay. He spaced out thinking about what happened. I guess you're supposed to just get paranoid about whatever I am in Chan's hair. But there's no actual management mechanic. At least I think. Okay, let me check out... Nothing there. No one there. Just go to bed. Don't stay up late, you all know what happens. Day four. No one's at the door. Look around, but no one resembles the person from before. What kind of anime is this even supposed to be? Eh, no one there. No one there. You go to the bathroom. As you get from yourself and towards your bed, you suddenly get hit by nausea. You wobble over to the bathroom to cool off your face. My head still aches. Wash face. You stare at your reflection. Do we just keep washing our face? Someone takes multiple passes. You look like shite. Hayami-chan. You stand still frozen in fear. Just wash your face, she's not there. Hayami-chan, not real. Now we go back. We went to bed. You check the lock on the apartment door and it's locked. There's no way she could have gotten in. She can't be a mere hallucination. Is she a ghost? He's based thinking about what happened. I just won't watch anime in peace, man. So if we went back, I think Hayama Chen would have got us. We would, we would acknowledge she was there. This is not that bad of a deal when you think about it. He did say he wanted his wife to be real. Well, here you go. Let me have a better taste than waifus. I'm surprised she hasn't come at us from the people at this rate. I keep worrying she's gonna be like in the hallway. Hey! 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 Huh! We should go check out the fuse box. Feel a shiver going down your spine. It's her again. Go away! Oh no. There's something blocking the people. Why is it all black? It's all black. Can't see a thing. Jump out, Jen! Don't move. She can't sense humans. A young man in his 20s was found dead in his own apartment. Neighbors called the authorities after hearing a loud scream. When the police arrived at the scene, the door to his apartment was locked. With many failed attempts at getting the young man to open the door, they broke down the door and let themselves in. There on the sofa in the living room were the young man, dead. He had paid.
pale skin and an abnormal white gaping mouth. The butt was cold to the touch, which was odd since neighbors reported him to scream not long after the police arrived. On the television was a DVD of an animated cartoon playing. One of the officers retrieved the DVD and placed it in one of his pockets when the other officers were questioning the neighbors. And so, the cycle continued. <laughs> I can't, I'm not sure, but I think that's it for Hayami-chan. So I, I guess you just can't escape your fate. You you want your waifu to be real, and she became real in the worst way possible. <laughs> or the best way. I mean, yeah, you know, you, you know some people, right? So, Hayami-chan herself, I, I think she, I suspect she's just an MMD model. Or something weird. Just with a little filter over here. Um, it, it works. Either way, I guess. It's kind of creepy looking. And the parts where Hayami appeared were actually kind of creepy. They're, they're, they're just simple. It makes me think of like a Flash game. Uh, like I said, the horror Flash game Newgrounds era. Uh, it's a little too bad there's not as much lead up to Hayami's appearance. It's kind of like she only appears in the final days. Um, it would have been nice just to have some atmospheric sounds or build up in those first days. Because it's trying to do something where... You're, you're just watching anime and things are just normal, and it's just like normal, 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 uh oh! Kind of like that, but it needs, it needs a little more trickle, it needs a little more trickle in. Because you, you don't need a complicated concept to uh, make a little kind of short, spooky, uh, free horror game. You, you can just have your game basically be glorified just JPEGs of something looking at you at a distance, and that's, you know, that's, that's fine for if you just want to spook someone real quick. But some build up would have been nice to kind of elevate that, I think. Anyway, Sophie Gill for watching me play Hayami Chan. I'll see you guys later and take it easy.